I am on my way to Toronto. It's about a six hour drive. We just pulled over to the on route to go to the bathroom and get gas. We just arrived to Toronto and our Airbnb is not ready. So we went to a coffee shop to use the bathroom and got some coffee. I'll insert the clip now of what the coffee looks like. The owner there was so nice. He's drinking the coffee. We just parked our car and now we are paying. I'm now just walking to the library until the Airbnb is ready and I'm gonna chill there and make my book. It's quite chilly outside today. Here's a little Airbnb tour. It's an apartment in downtown Toronto. We are five people staying at this apartment. You know, gotta save money. It was expensive, so the more the merrier. Here's the kitchen. And then there's this, someone's gonna be sleeping on the couch. We have a little balcony with a view of Toronto. Here there's a TV. And then you walk into the room, which is the one I'm staying in. And there's this little sign that says, Never stop dreaming. And there's a big window with a view here. Window continues onto here. It's with the balcony. So this is the room. And for the bathroom, there is this with the shower. Now we're going to eat lunch. We are now walking to the CN Tower. <laughs> There is a hockey game tonight, so we might come watch it. I'll show you the location of where it is. There's like an outdoor screen. Being awake at 5 a.m. got me tired. I'm now going to the hockey game. Going grocery shopping. This is the Airbnb room at night. Um, it's pretty bright because of the city lights. But yeah, it's super chill. Good morning, everybody. It is day two in Toronto. The plan for today is we are going to the Microsoft headquarters because my boyfriend works there and he wants to show us around. And then once it warms up, I think we are going to walk along the pier, have a little picnic there, see some parks. There's a botanical garden there. Not too sure if the garden is ready or not because it is spring, like the weather's not the best still, but we're gonna check it out. And I'll keep you updated on what else we decide to do. I think tonight we might do a karaoke night. Not too sure, so I'll keep you updated.
we went to the music garden and conventional park and while we were there we saw this light thing which we're gonna go back to tonight i am back at the airbnb now and i'm gonna eat so i'm now walking to the eaton center and it's such a beautiful sunny day outside kind of cold so i do have this fleece jacket on with lights tonight so it's yeah, going. today's outfit. So this is where we're going for breakfast. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, so this is my first time using a tiny microphone. We're at the aquarium, it's right behind me. It's uh, Ripley's Aquarium. It's right next to the CN Tower. Um, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so now while uh, everyone's on this moving um, platform here, I'm gonna walk you through this aquarium part. So if you look up, you can see a shark. Oh, the shark swam away, but you know, you can look up and you can see some fishies. Let's continue walking. So yeah, there's some stingrays, some sharks, some fish, a lot of people. Oh, see, that's the shark I was talking about. Now I am in an art museum. It's uh, the Art Museum of Ontario. Now at a restaurant called Fox and Fiddle. I'm now going to an arcade slash bar. This is my outfit for the night. The top is thrifted and then these pants were the same ones I wore today. They're from H&M. And then of course, because it's cold outside, I'm gonna have to wear a sweater. We are walking to this place. It's about a 20 minute walk from the Airbnb. Yeah. 
It is day four in Toronto and we are leaving. There's a marathon going on. It's our first time trying Popeyes. 